The return of college basketball to New Mexico State and Kentucky ready to get things started. Welcome everybody. You're in and you're out, but in a total rebuild mode. Freshman getting it started for Kentucky in the first shot. By the Duke, yeah. Wildcats want to get out and run. So far, the Aggies have been back. Edwards from the elbow. 6'8 oh. freshman from Philadelphia. DJ Wagner, freshman from Camden, New Jersey, kicks out. Edwards throws it down in his first three of the night. Wagner got it to go. He is so tough to stay in front of. It's got five. Five point game. Drive it off the glass for Dillingham, as you suggested. Here's Edwards. Reeves never shy. Got it. Well, they're getting some open looks from three in transition. New Mexico. And now Reeves again. At 83's last season, he's got two here in the first half. You just really think he's not going to pull from that deep. You better get out there and make him put it on the deck. Well, you're going to get a lot of those uh, principal verticality jumps where guys jump up in the air and build a wall because of the new rule change. Shepard tipped control. it away for the steal, and he'll pay it off on the feed from Wagner. First Kentucky bucket. Starting with his defense. Well, the active hands there, and of course, Wagner with the loose ball. Great left hand kick ahead to Shepard. And not a better way to have your first bucket in the box score. In Washington, you go back and back to say, all right, the three's not going for us. How else are we going to get some offense? Another steal for Shepard. And the follow by Jordan Burks. Well, if Shepard can afford. Shepard ahead. And a good looking shot for Antonio Reeves. Just Aggies aren't shooting at a high clip, but they made up for it with five offensive rebounds. Look at that. Shepard with a hand in his face. Uh, I love it. As a shooter, don't you dare disrespect me by going up. Just an easy read for Shepard. Defender goes under the ball screen. Mr. Cook wasn't paying attention to the scout report. On fifth. But Coach Hoot has wanted to teach his guys to learn how to compete harder. I think he's got to be pretty pleased right now with this effort. Mitchell steps through, rolls it all. First good time. Edwards pulls up for three. Got it off the feed from Mitchell. Not indicative of the promise of this team in this freshman class, and a goaltending call will count the bucket for DJ Wagner. I can't. This is the turnover. He's the last one at the other end of the court, and then makes a scoring cut as Coach Kyle likes to talk to. 6'3, 175, freshman point guard. Mitchell puts it on the floor this time, and he finishes. And that's what he's got to do. Make. Wagner got caught in traffic. Here's Dillingham. Got it. Well, when you can penetrate and make the defense suck in on your. Put it up from deep. This is how you want your half court offense to look the penetration, pass, splash. Well, you never know who's going to be in Rupp Arena for the first time. Kentucky with a 15 point lead. And tonight it's Jim Fink at 90 years young. His buddy Corey Price brought him to the game today, part of his 90th birthday bash. Lifetime Kentucky fan, but has never been to a Kentucky game until now, and now his phone's going to start blowing up. But Jim was born in you know, and just finished his third season as the head coach for Kentucky. The Wildcats had just finished their first season in the SEC. Retired from the United States Air Force, United States Postal Service, and the Jefferson County Sheriff's Office. On top of that, longtime member of the Knights of Columbus for 70 years, including 40 years as a treasurer. And these two were co workers at Kroger for 15 years. So, special happy birthday to Jim Fink. And thanks to Corey Price for bringing this to our attention. Hey, Corey, look, they put me on TV. <laughs> My first game. They must do this for every game. How cool is that? 121 seasons of Kentucky basketball. Great pass and the flush from Burks.
It must be exhausting to have Reed Shepard guarding. Isiago strip. Here's Reeves. Steps through. Oh, finishes off the glass. Six nothing run. Timeout. New Mexico State. Eight inches of it. No. <laughs> Edie did not have an issue winning the tip. Reigning National Player of the Year, Shepard. Beautiful shot. He's in the double figures. Taken away by Reeves. Push ahead for Dillingham. And he gets it to go. Nine points for Rob Dillingham, freshman from Hickory. Faster end to end player in the SEC this year than Dillingham. That is just elite speed and body control. Always. I look for three and red to be an impact player for the Aggies from deep. Shepard turns the corner, goes with the left. The breather here. And a big ovation to go with it. Mitchell down the lane. Whoa! Two hand jam! <laughs> a man jam for 20. Wagner, somebody lost their show, but Edwards didn't lose the rim as he throws down the dunk. When you drive past the guy and he comes shooting from deep, you don't forget about their ability to get above the rim, and Mitchell pleases the crowd on that one. And how about the activity by Edwards on the great cut? His first game, too. So we got a 90-year-old at his first game, and what do we got, I guess, there, a four-year-old? You go four, get look at? Uh, I love it. Yeah. Pre-kindergarten? Yes, there's Jim. 90 years old in his first game, and his phone is still red hot. Done such a great job with for 90 years. All of his brothers at Knights of Columbus are firing their texts. There's Dillingham with the floater. It's... Wagner got his hands on it. And he takes it in with the left. He'll go to the line. The activity and aggressiveness by Wagner. I mean, this guy has had this jump ball to now with a 25-point lead. He does not play the scoreboard. He just gives you 100% effort all game long. It's really improve on throughout the course of the season is just in transition and knowing when to attack, how to attack, and being a little bit more careful with that handle. He's a freshman. We've got Onyenso, 7 feet, 247. When I saw Onyenso, when we were here for Big Blue Madness, it was immediately apparent that he's even bigger than he was last year. Wagner's first three. Well, and, and they're going to need it. And I, I think college basketball. Kansas State, those guys are both two-time transfers. That's an easy look for Edwards on the back cut. you got to love that from Edwards. I mean, he bothered by an injury and yeah, not able to go. Shepard finds it. Numbers for the Cats, five on two. And it will go for Wagner. Lucky fans know while you want to win them all, it's more important to be able to take down Kansas in March than it is November. Dillingham with the three, with contact at the feet. He's got 15. Well, Slade is subs ready to check in at a dead ball. Here's Dillingham with the reverse. And he's getting his late. He's got 17, 13 on to Hart. Right in Canada. Burks will pull from deep. Got it! There's seven and a half seconds left. Yeah, but scholarship player not allowed to pull it. <laughs> and the walk on top. Nice shot by 23 nonetheless. It was an eight-point game at the half, and the catch with the 100th all-time win in season opener is now 13-2 under John Calipari. They have scored in the second half 49-17. Speak of Reed Shepard in a few minutes, but before that, plenty to keep you uh, up to date with back in the studio.